There are rich opportunities for learning about scientific phenomena and complex ecological systems. Because young learners will inherit these systems in the future, it's important for them to understand the challenging work that goes into keeping a system in balance. The New York Hall of Science developed Connected Worlds, a large immersive simulation to give visitors an experience with complex ecology. It includes four habitats, desert, grasslands, wetlands, and jungle that share water from a single source, the waterfall. In Connected Worlds, visitors can root water to a habitat using synthetic logs and grow plants by sowing seeds. With water changing course and plants and animals appearing constantly, most visitors are so focused on what they're doing that they can't tell the story of how their actions affected the whole system. Our goal was to automatically generate a digital recap of the Connected Worlds experience that it would help them recall their actions and the effect of their actions on the ecosystem. To help students make sense of their interactions in Connected Worlds, we designed a three-day learning experience. On the first day, in the classroom, we provided resources for students to familiarize themselves with the interactions in Connected Worlds and the relationship between plants and animals of each habitat. During their visit to Connected Worlds on the second day, students were divided into teams and given the goal of managing their habitat to see every plant and animal that lives there. On the third day, back in the classroom, students discussed what they have seen and the challenges they faced when managing shared water while viewing an interactive visualization of their session. Our interactive visualization is composed of three parts. A stylized video of the Connected World simulation session shows how visitors directed the water with the synthetic logs. The time-aligned animated bar graphs show the amount of water in each habitat and the number of plants and animals of different levels. The line graph shows the amount of water over time overlaid with color-coded blocks that mark the salient time segments of stable water flow. The machine learning algorithm used to infer these stable water flow time segments is a major piece of computer science developed for ESSEL. So how did it all work out? The students found the stylized video of the placement of the logs and the resulting path of the water easy to interpret and referred to it in retelling their story of how they moved logs to reroute the water. They watched as the animated bar graphs that indicated the appearance of plants and animals changed over time and synchronized with the video. While we worried that the fifth graders might have trouble with the graphs of change over time, the fact that these graphs were based on their own experience made them much more accessible. Compared to most visitors, these students were much more able to tell the story of what resulted from their collective actions in the Connected Worlds ecosystem. We hope that our process of using machine learning algorithms and data visualizations can become the basis of similar ways for students to deepen their relationship with complex ecological systems.